Hello and welcome back to my channel. So if you're new here, please consider subscribing. Hit the like button and share. Um, I'm actually going to do a palette review. Um, the Lorelai, the Laurel, Laurel, Laurelai, uh, Desert Sky. It's real Desert Sky. It's really pretty. I've already played with it, um, but I want to actually really uh, get a better feel of if I like it or not. So we're going to do a look. Alrighty, I put down our Desert Skies right here just to kind of give like a base. Um, I don't usually use eyeshadow primer. I just put concealer, you know, so we're going to go ahead and start out with Mojave and I'm going to put this up pretty high. I do have hooded eyes. Um, so I need to get this kind of like way up here. So I'm just going to kind of place it down, place it and kind of form kind of the shape I want to start out with. This is going to be a good transition color. I actually started liking um, using kind of like semi shimmers for transitions. Um, something I was scared to do for some reason, but I really like it. Okay, so let me go ahead and just get this going and I will be right back. Okay, so I'm done with that. Um, I really love the, the shimmers. The shimmers in this palette, I'm not going to lie. Um, we're going to go ahead and go into uh, Horizon. I really love this color. I've already done a few looks with this one. But um, we're going to go into Horizon. And again, I want to keep this pretty high because I have really hooded eyes. <laughs> um, Horizon is a matte. So we're just going to go ahead and build this up. Build it up, build it up. You know the drill. Build it up. Build it up takes forever <laughs> but I love makeup no makeup's truly um, a passion of mine I enjoy doing it and I enjoy uh, practicing I guess you could say um, I'm not a makeup artist by any means I've learned everything I know um, from YouTube basically so there's that I'm gonna go ahead and build this color up more um, I'm gonna keep adding because it's kind of like one of those colors that you've got to do that with, you know, you just got to kind of build her up, build her up. Um, the mattes are, they're, they're really, I don't know, I would say they're not as pigmented as I would want, um, but you can build them up, so we're good. So I'm grabbing a brush that has no product on it, and I'm just going to go ahead and kind of like lighten this, like the edges, um, blend them a little better. It was funny, like right when I said the mattes weren't, um, pigmented enough. I went to this eye and because that I had such product on it, it really like showed through immediately. So don't be afraid to dig into these colors. You know what I mean? It's not like, um, what do you call it? It's not like you got to be careful with how much you use, I guess is what I'm trying to say. So we're just going to try to blend this a little bit better and I'll be right back. Okay. Now for the next step, I'm going to use some powder underneath my eyes just because of, uh, just in case of fallout because it is a dark color that I'm going to go into so I do apologize for the way I look just ignore it for now okay <laughs> all righty I don't know what my hair is doing just ignore that <laughs> we're gonna go into mirage very dark deep 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 blue I love this color so much I'm gonna tap it I don't want I want to be careful and I'm gonna get the outer corner Wow, that one's actually really pigmented. Oh my goodness, what am I going to do here? I'm glad I tapped that actually. So for the darker pigments, you're going to want to be careful. Whoop. As I mess up. <laughs> oh my goodness, let's build her up. I don't want to... This one I'm kind of putting directly in my crease, sort of. And I'm blending it through. and work on it for a bit. It's gonna take a minute. So hold that thought. Okay, so I'm gonna actually grab some and put some in my like inner corner right here. I actually quite like the way that the colors are blending together. 
Um, they're not really becoming like, what do you call it? But you know when eyeshadow palettes, like, you, they, you blend them and then it just all kind of meshes and it's like one color as opposed to all the colors you put down. Um, this stays true to, you know, they don't, they don't, how do I put this? Mix and look muddy, I guess. I don't know. I can't explain it. You guys know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and finish the other eye. Hold on. Okay, so we're done for the most part. Um, I'm going to pick a shimmer. Now, this is kind of hard because there's so many pretty shimmers. I don't even know. Like, I'm going to go ahead and hmm, lighten the mood maybe with Wildflower. Or should I do Oasis? I don't know, you guys. It's so hard. Um, hmm. Oasis would be like a nighttime look and then Wildflower would be day. So we'll just do Wildflower. I'm going to dip my finger in. This is how I usually apply shimmer. Look at that. It's beautiful. So we're going to go ahead and pop her on. Oh wow, that's really pretty. Wow. Wow. Are you guys seeing this? What are you thinking? If you got this palette, please let me know in the comment section below. Let me know if you liked it, um, your thoughts on it. I would really appreciate that because I personally love it. Like, I mean, the glitter is a little bit, like it's falling out. I'm glad I had the, um, I'm glad I had the powder, but, um, you, you know, I'm placing a lot down. Ooh, I want to just cover my eye with it, to be honest with you, but hold on. Let me, hold on. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and pop on some mascara, eyeliner, maybe a lash. I don't know. What do you think? This is going to take forever. So I'm going to go and do this. I may be back with lashes. <laughs> okay, so we're back. I popped on some lashes. We're good to go put a light lip on um I, I you know f let's rate it okay so one being like a chalky dollar store almost kid makeup uh no name brand and five being like Natasha Denona um Anastasia Beverly Hills I would give this a three and a half almost a four like I've played with it a couple times now and usually when I'm getting to know a palette and how it blends and how it performs it takes me a little while to really get like a full um I guess judgment or whatever but yeah I would say three and a half possibly four it's really good um I don't know what do you guys think if you got this palette you know whether it was in your slay glam box or whatever or you have the um i can't say that laurella laurella i don't know if you have that box i know that they have a box so let me know what you thought i would love to hear your opinions peace love stay positive even though it's really hard sometimes and i'll catch up with you later